And so, as you know, this uh, Jasmine Penix was originally charged with a felony, but in court here today, that was reduced to a misdemeanor when he agreed to plead no contest, and he'll spend no more time there in the county jail. That cell phone video went viral, showing Penix losing his temper, shoving the 14-year-old over a desk, and taking him to the ground, grabbing him around the neck. The boy wasn't seriously injured. An investigation later showed the boy and his friends planned to antagonize Penix in class in hopes of getting him fired. Both sides agreed that didn't give Penix a license to lose it in class, but it certainly factored into their decision to reduce the charge to a misdemeanor battery and recommend no jail time. Certainly conduct by the victim and other students in this case that uh, although no justification for Mr. Penick's actions, I, I think certainly led to uh, the ultimate consequences of what happened in this case. And in particular, this unfortunate thing had happened on this day. I can't take it back. I wish I could. wish it never took place what happened. But overall, I'm remorseful. Now, the judge sentenced Penix to three days in jail, time, though, that he's already served when he was first arrested in this case. There's no more jail time or even probation. Penix was fired by MPS and says he hasn't been able to find a job. Reporting live at the county courthouse, Nick Board, WISN 12 News. Thank you.